welcome back to my channel. So today we have our first guest, a very special guest, my niece, Gabby Victoria. Hi. So if you don't already know Gabby, go over to her channel, check it out, give her a like and a subscribe. She's a pretty cool kid with a pretty cool aunt. So I was born in 19, you know what? The year's not important. I was born in a year that made me part of the millennial generation. And Gabby was born as a part of Generation Z. So as you can imagine, each of us has our own slang. And Gabby's here to quiz me on the slang from Generation Z. So what do you think, Gabby? Do you think I'm gonna be able to get it? I think some words you'll get, but some words you might. Like I know you're not gonna know what So I'm pretty up to date. Like I teach college students, age like 16 to 45. So I think I might be able to get quite a few of them. And so if I get five out of 10 right, then what do I get? You get ice cream from 32 <laughs> degrees. Okay, so if I get five out of 10, then I get ice cream from 32 degrees. If I don't get five out of 10, then I have to get you ice cream from 32 degrees. All right? <laughs> Let's get started. Root for me, everybody. You guys can't see what they are either. Um, um, I got this. I feel like I got this. Okay. I'm pretty hip. Here's one I think you would know. I'm still saying hip. Um, yeah. <laughs> they, they actually say hip. Hip? Yeah. Okay. This is the first word. Beef what's for dinner. But, okay, in like slang, beef is like if you have a problem with somebody. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I got one. I got one. So we're just gonna flip it over. Okay. So the next one is fire. Okay, fire is, um, it's like if something is really good. Yeah. Like, you're like, that's fire. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. I didn't know you knew that. I be hanging with the youths, okay? Okay, so, so the third one is move. Move? People be like, what's the move? <laughs> what's the plan? No. What's the plan? Um, what's the move? What's the move? What's 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 uh, the party? Like, it's basically where is everybody gonna be? Where are we hanging out? Yeah. What's the move? So did okay. you say? No. I, on the second time, I said party. Mm, I guess you can get that. We'll put that as a maybe. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see if I need it to cross the finish line. This one is a acronym, is that what you call it? Like where's? The letters mean something? Yeah. Maybe. So. This is the next one. Oh, I know that one. That means hit me up. Yeah. If you trying to make the move. <laughs> would you say that? Could, could I say that? Is, I, would you guys say that? What, hit me you, up. You, you'd be like, what's the move? Hit H me up. H and U. Yeah. That's three. <laughs> I told y'all, I hang out with youths. So this is the next one. Beat. Yeah. Um, oh, that's when you beat your face, your mud. That means you have a good makeup job. Yeah. <laughs> you know, beat is actually a word that we used when I was growing up too. You wanna beat that mug of yours? So beat. how many is You got all the four. So far, right? Except for the um move. We said the move was amazing. Okay, here's the next one. Cop. <laughs> so cop is not police. It's not police. Um, cop is like you want to buy, you want to get it, like you want to buy it. Like I want to cop. Uh, <laughs> I want to cop that fire. Uh, fire what? Fire toothbrush. I want to cop that fire toothbrush. What's the move? Hit me up. <laughs> That's 
real sus. Sus is um, suspect. Yeah, but it also can be suspicious. <laughs> yeah, but like, what's up, sus? Why do you call somebody sus? Like, it's basically another word for sis. Well, I th I've heard people use sus before. Instead of sis? Yeah. So, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so, I'll be like, what up, sus? I want to cop that fire uh, passport. No beef. What's the move? Hit me up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, so the next one is. I messed up right there. I'm weak. I'm weak. It means that's so funny, but I don't feel like laughing. No. So I'm just gonna say, I'm weak. No. It doesn't mean it's funny. It means it's funny, but it means you're laughing. Like, but people don't always laugh when they say, I'm weak. They're like, I'm weak. But I'm weak means you're laughing so hard that you're weak. I'm weak means I'm laughing inside. No. So much. That's I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So, you got beef. You got beef with the girl with the beat. fire, with the fire beat. I'm weak. But uh, what's the move? Hit me up. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay, next one is you don't want to smoke. <laughs> okay, so it means, like you're a homeowner and uh, you don't want there to be a house fire because then you have to pay for like insurance. No. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm a homeowner. I know I don't want no smoke damage in my home, because that would take forever to, to repair. No. Uh, uh, if you don't want no smoke, it's, um, you don't want no beef. Basically, like, you don't want confrontation. You don't want a problem with me, because I will bring the smoke or the fire. Hit me up. <laughs> I know you know what this next one is. I'm dead. T. T. Girl. The T. <laughs> That's the gossip girl. Yeah. What are the details, honey? Yes! So, how many is that? That's 10. And you basically got all of them right. <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you I was hip. I spent time hanging out with young people. I know the move. You don't want any beef with me. I've got that fire slang. <laughs> Hit me up for the tea. You don't want smoke. I'm weak. Sus. <laughs> well, Gabby, thanks for coming out. You know, keeping me hip, hip to the slang of Generation Z. Meet me back next time. Maybe I'll try you with the slang from my generation. Mm. <laughs> also, you owe me ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. See you next time. I will add.